And when you think about Chloe, what are the feelings or expressions that come to mind about this brand? It's an idea of freedom, I think, and of joy. There's the idea of like things moving, things dancing, close to dancing, I guess. For me, it's so Parisian that I'm so happy that it's coming back and that she's back. Is the quintessential Paris girl. You know, Chloe has this very long history, all of these eras with all these different designers. Is Do you have a favorite moment from the history of Chloe that you're thinking about today? Uh, it relates obviously to Carl. I think it's the first time that Carl may be alive again at Chloe. He captured the essence of the 70s and the joie de vivre and the freedom. I think was was at the beginning a brand from a woman for other women. We loved Chloe by Carl really deeply. We loved Chloe by Stella. We love the bananas. So we are very happy today to see the banana back. But we look forward for a new version of a woman creating for other women in Paris for Chloe. I would say one of my favorite uh, Chloe women, I mean designer was Stella and I will never forget like the pineapple, the lobster. It's a very playful brand. It's girls who like to have fun. And are you wearing new Chloe? How does it feel for you? I love it because it's very feminine, which is part of Chloe, and I love that. It's stuff that we want to wear. The jewelry is gorgeous. I love everything. My little banana earring. I thought it was really beautiful. First of all, that's what really struck me is watching those fabrics move, those sleeves, those dresses. But then you also really saw the personality of this woman. She's, I don't think she's just creating her, she's speaking to her. This is someone who already exists, you know? Like you sort of feel like, okay, I can see who's buying those clothes. I can see who's aspiring to buy those clothes. And that's really what I was thinking about. It was so easy and it was gorgeous and it was so Shamina, but it was also so Chloe. And she's so good with fluidity. And I think that it made me think of like, like that quintessential Chloe girl. She is the Chloe girl. I mean, I think it's like you see her walk out and she embodies that moment. She lives for all of the of what Chloe stands for. It's a full circle moment.